Very good morning, everybody. Am I audible to you? Yes, ma'am. Fine, great. And I'm seeing a large quantity of people today. Uh, we are having a larger amount of people gathering here today, right? What is the strength of the class today? Ten twenty. Ten twenty one. Ten twenty one. Great. Okay. Fine. And how is the weather today in Baspur? Ma'am, thirty degrees. Ma'am, thirty degrees Celsius. I, I didn't ask about the temperature. I asked about the temp. I asked about the weather. Hmm. Ma'am, बाहर धूप निकल रही है. Oh. We should be speaking in English. Let's do. You forgot that. Ma'am, outside is sunshine. Outside is sunshine. Did you say that? Yes, sunshine. Ah, okay. That that is not the correct. Uh, uh, that is not the correct sentence that you should be using. You should be using either if you want to say that bahar dhup hai. No, there is the sun is shining. Okay, the sun is shining. Shining. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Yes, ma'am. The sun is shining, right? There is a lesser amount of fog today, and we are having a sort of pleasant weather today. Okay, who is sitting at the back in in the bench? Who is there? Vishali. Vishali. And Vishali. What happened, Vishali? Are you not feeling okay? Are you not feeling good today? She is. She is. Her life. What happened? Her life. Her life. Her life. You shouldn't be. No, like to me, you shouldn't be. Uh, restricting yourself from speaking, but try to speak in English. She is ill. She is ill. Oh, she is not feeling well. Yes. Yes. Okay. Fine. Take care of yourself, Vishali. Take proper medicines and all. The weather is not appropriate. You should be taking care of yourself. Okay. Yes. Okay. Fine class. So in the previous session, uh, in the uh, Saturday session, we had I had given you some assignment to do, right? Yes, ma'am. The students who were present, uh, the ten students who were present on Saturday, can you please raise your hands so that I can see the fresh faces that are here today? Just Saturday. There were those who were present on Saturday. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Is there somebody who's ten? Okay, fine. Okay, girls, please grab your hands. And what about the students who are present today in the class that are present only today that were not present on Saturday? Pretty good. Fine. Okay, please down your hands, girls. Okay. so uh, today for those who are new to the class uh, welcome to the first class of 2024 we are back here after a month and um, now onwards as we had talked already that we are going to have a we are we are about to uh, end this class for the session in the next 10 to 12 days there are just 10 to 12 days left for us in the class for class 7 and it's, it's up to you if you want to continue it in class 8 also अच्छा एक मिनट आर यू गेटिंग व्हाट आई एम स्पीकिंग यस सबको समझ में आ रहा है यस मैम सो देयर आर ओनली अ फ्यू डेज लेफ्ट टू यू फॉर टेकिंग दिस क्लास राइट एंड वी आर गोइंग टू एंड दिस अप एज लॉन्ग एज योर एज सून एज योर एनुअल एग्जाम्स आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट ओके सो प्लीज डू इनफॉर्म मी वंस द अपडेट शीट इज आउट ओके यस मैम फाइन ओके so on the saturday uh, on the session that we had conducted on saturday i had given you some homework how many of you how many of those 10 girls have done that work what the work that was given to you on saturday what about that work then five seven five sentences mm -hmm. at least five sentences yes that experience of your holiday experience of your vacation and the new year yeah. that was what was given to you right 
okay so how many of you have, how many of you had done that work then five 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 girls have done the work no ma'am how many of you had done the work i said kitne bachcho ne kiya hai wo kaam uh one two dipika have you done the work yes ma'am You are also done. I'm not able to see your hand now. Actually, okay. One, two, three. Yes, raise your hand. Who had done the work? Four. Just four girls had done the work. What about the rest of the students? Ma'am, four. That's it. That is what I'm saying. This four out of ten. Such a disappointing number. You know, forty percent who had done the work. Ma'am, five. Ma'am, five. Five. Who is the other girl? Who is the I'm first? Sonakshi, Jasmine, Sonakshi. Where is Sonakshi? I'm not able to see Sonakshi. Where is Sonakshi? Sonakshi is back. Okay, fine. Okay, okay, girls. So we are we 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 are having a ratio of fifty fifty. That means the fifty percent of you have done the work and fifty percent haven't done the work. Okay, fine. So can we begin with Sonakshi, please? Sonakshi, are you going to explain us? Uh, are you going to speak about your experience of your vacations first? Come. Yes. What is space called? Yeah, bedroom. Which one? 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 Yes, Sanakshi. Can we have your experience of your vacations, please? Yes, ma'am. Without taking the help of the notebook, without the notebook. Yes, ma'am. No, you should be confident enough that you are able to speak about your own self without the help of the notebook. Okay. Fine. I I feel very good and happy on my holiday. Okay. I feel very enjoyness. Enjoyness. That is no word. Enjoyness. I enjoyed. You should be saying this. Okay. Yes, I enjoyed. You enjoyed. Sorry. Yes. What did you enjoyed in your vacations? Yeah. <laughs> Ask me if you are not able to speak. Speak in Hindi. Acha, listen to me one. Uh, one thing, the first, the very first sentence that you spoke, you said that you feel very happy and what you said? Well, I am feel very good and happy. Okay, you feel. Uh, acha, vacations ja chuke hain, right? Complete ho gaye na? है ना तो जब काम कंप्लीट हो चुका होता है तो वी यूज द पास टेंस ओके तो दैट्स नॉट फील दैट शुड बी फेल्ट ओके इट शुड बी यस तो व्हाट शुड द करेक्ट सेंटेंस बी फेल्ट आई आई फेल्ट वेरी गुड एंड हैप्पी पीछे सुन ले सकते हो ना ओके मैम सेकंड आई फील वेरी अगेन यू फील यू फेल्ट The the work has already done. No, that has already completed. So you should be using felt past form. Yes, I felt very enjoy. Enjoy. No, I enjoyed a lot. You should be saying this. Okay, felt enjoy. करना जो होता है ना see अ कुछ चीजें करना मतलब मजा करना right तो enjoy का मतलब you should you should not feel it. Enjoy करना नहीं होता enjoy करना तो you should be saying enjoy only enjoyed. enjoy or enjoy okay in past tense that is not felt fine hmm. Hmm. i enjoyed that's it i felt to i felt very nice very nice yes that the the same, the same thing is repeated again and again and again try something new what did you uh, what you did in the vacations kahan the aap were you there in baspur only ya kahin gaye कहीं गए थे मैम बुआ के घर तो वेद जी अब बुआ ले कहां पे रहती है बुआ मैम मैम मुरादाबाद कहां सॉरी मैम मुरादाबाद मुरादाबाद ओके तो हाउ डिड यू फील गोइंग टू मुरादाबाद 
How was your experience of being in Muradabad? So you should be saying this, no? Uh, yeah, bolo. Pehle pehle bolo. Yes. Did you feel in Muradabad? I feel in Muradabad. How did you feel in Muradabad? How was your experience in Muradabad? Uh, was the weather good, or was that bad, or was that okay, okay? Or how did you enjoy it in Muradabad? कैसा लगा? अच्छा लगा? ओके वहाँ पे क्या क्या किया आपने? आप घर में ही थे मुरादाबाद या मुरादाबाद में कहीं घूमे भी हो? मैं बुआ के घर थी। बुआ जस बुआ के घर ही थे? अच्छा अब इसको इंग्लिश में कैसे बोलेंगे? क्या मैं बुआ के घर गई थी वेकेशंस में? I am going a I am going जा रहे हो? नहीं गए थे। Past friends I I went going no went is the past form of go went is the past form of go you shouldn't be saying went going no went hmm. I went go hmm. I went to I went to hmm. where did you went where did you go Muradabad, I went to my Bua's place. Repeat with me. I went to my Bua's place. Bua in English, we call it aunt. Okay. Uh, whenever there is a female, you should say aunt. Whenever there is a male, you should say uncle. Okay. Sabi rishto ke alag alag naam hote. Likewise, in Hindi, we have mama, chacha, tauji, etc. These are uncle. And whenever you talk about Bua, Mosi, um, Mami, Chachi, etc., we call them aunt. Okay, so there is an, there are just two words. Uh, bus alag -alag jata hai, maternal, paternal. I'm not going that deep into it, but uh, aunt hoti hai, bua, chachi, whatever. In the female is always an aunt, and a male is always a an uncle. Okay, yes, so where did you went? Where did you go? Hmm. I went to uh, I went to aunt my my girls don't love yes mm -hmm. so I went to my aunt place to English me both either you say house you say home or you say you say place okay so place is the most appropriate word so buakagar that means aunt's place okay place I went to my aunt's place in Muradabad. Fine. Okay. And how did you felt in Muradabad? How did you feel in Muradabad? How was it? How was the weather there in Muradabad? Was that foggy? I feel in Muradabad. I feel in Muradabad. So, Nakshi, whenever you talk about your past experience, when you talk about your past experience, then you should always use the past tense. Okay? So, feel goes out and felt. I felt in Muradabad very nice. I felt very nice in Muradabad. I felt, no, it shouldn't be very nice. See, you should be saying good. If it feels good, then good. Okay? Yes. I felt in Muradabad. I felt good in Muradabad. I felt good in Muradabad. Yeah. So you should be revising. You should be bringing this in your practice. Okay. Both are fine. Okay. That's it, Sonakshi. Anything else to be added? That needs to be added. Yes or no? Yes, ma'am. What do you want to add in this? Yes. Yes, ma'am. Okay, but I have to tell me. Ma'am, there is a tenth mind. That's it, Abbas. These are the only sentences that you had formed. Now, what is it? That's it. No issue. I want a better, I want a better passage from the next time. Okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so now, please get back to see. Okay, next can we have the pick up you. What about your experience of your vacations? I feel good and I okay leave this. I don't want uh, this uh, mugged up 
classes to be repeated once again uh, tell me where did you went in your, where were you in your vacation kya uh, where were you in your vacations ab kahan the apne vacations mein that's it you want you didn't went anywhere you didn't go anywhere you were in your place only okay ab apne ghar pe kya kar apne vacations mein I I am help my mother. I am I help my mother. See, See, whenever you are explaining your past experiences, जब भी आप अपनी उन बातों को बता रहे हो जो ऑलरेडी हो चुका है द रेस्ट ऑफ द गर्ल्स डू राइट डू राइट अज राइट नाउ करंट अभी लिखिए Write about your experience of your vacation. Okay, I'm going to ask it from you now. Okay, then only नहीं लिखा है वो सब लिखेंगे. Note करना है सबको one one नहीं लिखना है. Yeah, typical. Uh, everybody first listen to me. See, whenever you uh, speak about your past experiences, past experience यानी जो हो चुका है. See, the vacations are already done, right? वो vacations हो चुके हैं complete and I, I am asking you about the vacation. तो जब हम पहले की बात कर रहे हैं, तो आप हमेशा past form को use करेंगे. In the very beginning of the session, I told you that you need to learn the forms of the verb, right? है ना? Forms of verb को याद करेंगे. Like feel का felt हो जाता है, uh, go का went हो जाता है. ठीक है राइट का राइट ही रहता है रिटर्न राइट रोट रिटर्न हो जाता है एक्सेट्रा दीज आर द थिंग्स दैट यू नीड टू रिमेंबर फॉर स्पीकिंग इन इंग्लिश ओके फाइन ओके गेटिंग माय पॉइंट या ओके सो you should be remembering that whenever you are speaking about your past experience you should be using the past form okay तो फील नहीं है फील का फेल्ट हो जाता है फील हुआ फील मतलब अभी कर रहे हो यू आर नॉट लिविंग योर वेकेशन राइट नाउ यू ऑलरेडी एक्सपीरियंस दोज ओके तो जब वेकेशन ऑलरेडी हो चुके हैं तो फील का फेल्ट होगा फाइन प्लीज कंटिन्यू विद योर सेंटेंस आई एम माय मदर फ्रॉम कुकिंग and hmm i am enjoy hmm my vacation from home hmm i i i feel good and happy hmm nice and how do you feel after coming to the school i'm excited excitement oh <laughs> you feel excited Yeah. Excited. Yeah, you feel excited coming back to the school. Great. Okay. Nice. Acha. Ah, uh, Deepika, listen to me. What What you spoke in the beginning? You said that you uh, you helped your mother, right? Hey, na? Okay. So, सबसे पहले तो whenever you speaking about your past experience, you should say I helped my mother. I am help नहीं होता है. Past form में I uh, is am are इतने ओके वो प्रेजेंट में ही होता है आई हेल्प माय मदर फ्रॉम यस आई हेल्प माय मदर इन व्हाट फ्रॉम कुकिंग फ्रॉम इन इन कुकिंग फ्रॉम मतलब से तो आपने कुकिंग से मम्मी की हेल्प की या कुकिंग में मम्मी की हेल्प की मे मे तो मे का होता है इन ओके आई हेल्प हेल्प माय मदर इन कुकिंग Okay, that's it in in just cooking or uh, some household chores also. Uh, and any one. <laughs> okay, acha listen to me everybody. There is another word that uh, we had from Deepika's conversation. Uh, that is ghar ka kaam jo hota hai, usko kya bolte hai? What do we call the ghar ka kaam in English? Home. Housework. Housework uh, isn't an appropriate word, but uh, the right word is household chores. Okay, what is it? Household chores. Okay. Household chores. Chow. C H A O S. Everybody, do write this word. Do you want me to open the board? Uh, is there a whiteboard there? No, sorry, is there a projector there? No. No, no. ma'am. Class. Let me display the screen only. है। 
Are you able to see? Are you able to see the board? Okay, just give me a minute. Okay, is it visible to you now? Are you received? No, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> okay, is it visible now? Is no, you... Acha, are you there in the class? Class, are you there in the classroom only? Yes, ma'am. Right. Uh, ma is ma'am there with you? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, can you please uh, write the write this word on over the blackboard, please? I'm not able to. I think the students are not able to see the screen properly. Board sitting, na sir. Ma'am, do you want me to repeat? Should I? You know, to the household. Ghar ka kaam jo hota hai, usko kya bolte? Household chaos. Ma'am, household chaos. C H A O S. C H A O S. C H O. C H O. R E S. R E S. It's household chaos. Okay. The R in chow. R chows. R in chows is silent. Okay. C H O R E S. It's pronounced. It is pronounced. As chows, okay. Chows. Hmm. The household chows mean घर के रोजमर्रा के काम like सफाई करना, खाना बनाना, planting and etc. All the work that are there in the household, यानी घर के रोजमर्रा के जो काम होते हैं, those are household chows. Okay. C H O R E S. Done. Yes. Done? Yes, ma'am. Okay, fine. Okay, Deepika. So that's it. That is what your sentence has formed. What should you be saying now? How you help your mother in your vacations? I help my mother mm. household and child. Household chows is the only word. I help my mother in household chows. I help okay. my mother in household chows. Yes, that is the correct sentence. Fine. I feel the enjoy and happy. I felt no. I enjoyed. I enjoyed. I, I enjoyed and happy. And felt happy. Okay, enjoy. Listen to me. Uh, whenever you speak, enjoy. करते हैं और happy होते हैं, है ना? See, they, see, understand. Everybody, look. Listen to me. What I'm speaking. This is an uh, this is an important thing that I'm discussing right there. See, enjoy. करते हैं, okay? और happy करते हैं, happy होते हैं. होते हैं. होते हैं, right? So, जो happy होते हैं, that is a noun. ओके ठीक है नहीं नोट नहीं करना है लिसन टू मी ओनली जब हैप्पी होते हैं वो फील करते हैं फील करना इज अ नाउन ओके एंड जब आप इंजॉय करते हो इंजॉय करना वो काम है दैट इज अ वर्क 
ओके तो एंजॉय के पीछे ईडी लगता है और हैप्पी हमेशा फील करता है सो दैट इज ऑलवेज फील हैप्पी या फीलिंग हैप्पी या फेल्ड हैप्पी ओके और एंजॉय का एंजॉयड हो जाता है दैट इज अ वर्ब ओनली ओके जब भी आप बोलेंगे तो यू शुड भी अगर आपको एक ही सेंटेंस में यूज करना है तो आप बोलेंगे आई एंजॉयड एंड आई फेल्ड हैप्पी रामनगर राइट Sorry, I'm so sorry, guys. Yes, yes, Deepika. I I had hmm? my sister hmm? in hmm? reading. Reading or studying? Studying. <laughs> okay, fine. Sorry guys, please excuse me for this. Yes. Okay, Dipika, that is what you did in vacation. Anything else do you want to say? I am learn my. I am. I. Hmm. I learned my homework. My holiday. Okay, so you learned your work in your holidays. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Fine. Nice. Sorry. Okay. Okay. There was a nice try. Everybody, please give a round of applause for the pick. I appreciate it. I appreciate your words. What happened? What is this? What is this going on in the class? What happened? Is there anything that worth mentioning? Just me. Yeah, we are going to take. I think that we are having. We need to end the class right here. We need to. Yes, we are going to take it tomorrow again. Okay. Yes, yes. Fine class. So be ready with your experiences. Okay, and be a little faster, please. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay, class. So that's it for today's session. We are going to take it tomorrow again, and. Uh, जितनी जल्दी आप एक्सपीरियंसेस खत्म करेंगे देन ऑनवर्ड्स आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू अबाउट द टेंसेस ओके दैट आई गोइंग टू हेल्प यू इन इंप्रूविंग योर इन योर इन योर स्पीकिंग ओके यू शुड बी यू शुड बी कंप्लीटिंग दिस वर्क फास्टर ओके यस मैम ओके सो क्लास दैट्स इट फॉर टुडे सेशन थैंक यू सो मच फॉर जॉइनिंग वी आर गोइंग टू सी यू टुमारो अगेन एट द सेम टाइम ओके यस मैम ओके क्लास गुड बाय Bye, Bye. Bye.